the update that just dropped on the Samsung Galaxy S24 Ultra addressing the vivid mode situation is possibly causing battery drain. There's been some issues on, uh, of people complaining about this. So after your phone updates, after it gets done doing the reboot, this is what I do. So I come over here to settings. I come on down here to device care. And first thing I do is I hit optimize. I do the whole optimize thing, right? Let it go through all that. Done. I do that. All right, next. The next thing that I do, and this is pretty basic, pretty simple. I come over here, I scroll up, and I go ahead and I close all the apps. And then what I do, I come over here to the Galaxy Store and to the Play Store. I open them both, not at the same time, of course. I'll open the Galaxy Store. I'll see if any apps need to get updated. I'll open the Play Store, see if any apps need to get updated. Then I will go ahead and do a restart on my device, restart it, and hope for the best. <laughs> now, it is very true that when Google, Samsung, Apple, doesn't matter who it is, they will release an update, and guess what? It'll affect battery life. It'll even affect the way certain apps operate. That's why I said, after you update your device, you want to go and you want to go to the Play Store and you want to make sure your apps are updated because developers are also aware of updates that are that are dropping on phones. So they go ahead and they they update their apps to match the update that's on the phone, if that makes any sense. I've, I remember, you know, S23 Ultra or with my iPhone. It's been this way since forever. And I'm an old school Android user, so I'm always on top of my phone. I'm always making sure that it runs right. And I'm, I'm highly aware of when updates are dropping and so on and so forth. So like I said, make sure all of your apps are updated. Make sure you go into your device care and you optimize it because that's what that's there for. I know some people say, well, you don't got to do that on an iPhone. Well, this isn't an iPhone. Uh, make sure you go over there to device care. Like I said, optimize everything and then go from there. And I made some videos the other day talking about how to get good battery life on your uh, Samsung Galaxy S24 Ultra. You got your power saving mode, tap on that thing right there. You see all of this right here. I also made a video explaining to you guys how to how to put apps to sleep and how to have your deep sleeping apps and all that other stuff. So on my phone, I put unused apps to sleep. I also talked talk to you guys about controlling your notifications and uh, just keeping track of what, what is actually sending you notifications. I guarantee we do not need all of our apps sending us crazy notifications. We just don't need it. I know there's a few apps that, you know, that we all rely on, that we all need to send us notifications. But, you know, you don't need them all. So control that, all right? And you'll get better battery life. Take care, everybody.